Hello everyone, Prey Scooter here, and welcome back to more Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. Last time, I have fed trees. And this time, we're going to be using our hookshot to like really good effect in this. I'm going to get some money back. Get that money back at guarantee. So anyway, on Pauper Island there is one place I forgot to get, uh... Wow, good shot, you almost hit me. There is one place I need to come back to, which I kind of panicked over not having, but we do need to... Get to this tree here, and go down this hole, which is where I, what we're missing. Wow, that uh, Hail Mary. Let's see. Ah, it's another battle dojo. Fight me. Nerds? Nerds? Hold on, I actually... Uh, I don't need my leaf right now. I need my arrows right now. That's the bad idea, actually. Switch them. I'm just going to light you on fire. Uh, shoot! They are freeze them. That usually just takes care of them for some reason. I think it's one of the ones that does summon. Okay, okay, you cast a spell. Good job. They're all defeated before they could do anything. I I feel like I'm cheating this really hard, by the way. I'm trying I've been trying to shoot this whole time. No casting spells. That is banned. No spell casting. No spell casting. I did you not hear what I said? Really, that only counts as one. Are we done now? Are we done? Did okay, we're done. <laughs> Man, everybody's so offensive out here. Everybody wants my blood, including me. As you hear me scribbling, that is our, that is a, got it. That is the treasure chart we're missing and the only reason we need to come back to Pawprint Island. Now this is treasure chart number 46, the last one in the, in the, in the lineup. Too fast. Too fast again. <laughs> I don't know my own strength. So then, now we have Treasure Chart 46. I propose that we actually take a trip back and we go over to another place we're at, which is Cliff Plateau. We visited there momentarily, but I think we should take a more calm approach to it, mainly on the upper side of it. So I'm going to head over to Cliff Plateau, which uh, just to get you a location on the map, was like somewhere around here. Oh, it's over there. Just east of Forest Haven, so yeah, I'll meet you over at uh, Cliff Plateau. I'm going the wrong way, still aren't I? I'm bad at compasses. Alright, so we may have made it back to Cliff Plateau, and I see the error I made, but I was a little more focused on, uh, you know, not losing my bearing, so to say. Anyway. Can I hookshot this? No, I can't, so I have to go back through the cave. Alright, fair enough. So let's let's proceed back through the cave. Now I have a little more time to breathe and I can think a little clearer. Let's uh, approach this a little more calmly. I really thought you could hookshot those trees up there. Oh well, must be a dad to the challenge anyway. 
We need our trusty left back out, so I'm gonna do this and this. And why don't and you might be asking, why don't I just remove the bottle? A bit. I'm gonna do a bit. Don't worry, it's coming. Anyway, so I approached this and I didn't think too much about this, and I don't think I did this the first time I ever came here, but uh Yeah, it just works. But what's what's the fun of that? Just live a little dangerously. Jump off stuff. Do a high flying stunt. Make panic for Link's life. Make him risk his life. Make him risk your life. Why is Link risking your life? I don't know. What did you do today? Why do you have this small stubby legged child after after your life? What did you do? Anyway. Anyway, I wish to be I wish to go into the pot now. And actually I'm gonna use this the cheap way to recover a little bit of magic here. Anyway, right back up we go. Now I'm gonna now over here I'm gonna take a moment. Other than some rupees, I think we actually did a good first clear of this little area. So up on Cliff Plateau, I literally could have just taken 30 seconds and gone over here and gotten this treasure chart. This treasure chart is number 25? Let's confirm. With my way too fast button mashing. You ready? I'm gonna go past it. Told you I would. Um... I can't place that one. <laughs> what is that place? I guess that's why they have the map like this. And I guess that's something that I think I'll actually do when it comes to completing, uh, getting all these is... Actually, let me do this. Is I plan to go through and do every single one of these uh, additional islands here. Or these treasure charts. Oh, is that home? That might be home. Uh, I plan to go through all of these treasure charts here, and I'm going to do them in order that they appear, so that way, even if I have collected them, I can at least show you where they were when I do that big ol' where is every treasure chart video. But hey, guess what? We only have one treasure chart left. But I'm going to divert, because I need to, we need to do something small. Who said you could be up here? And if you tell me, Mom, I'm going to I'm going to slap you. I almost said stab you, but uh, that, that job's already been done. Anyway, my slight diversion as I pass through a solid tree branch. Link died again. Is actually, there is some unfinished pieces I have on one last lookout. Or one last lookout post on the water. It's at Rock Spire. You think with how many times I've been there, I would have memorized it where it is. There it is. So I'm going to take a shortcut. I'm going to take a quick break from what I had planned. We're going to go over to Rock Spire Island and get this handled. So I'll meet you over at Rock Spire. So I lied. Um, apparently I can't realize my own notes that I've already cleared that, that particular plateau or by I cleared that particular lookout. So I'm just dumb. But anyway, we're now here on the private oasis. Oh, private oasis, if you would. We own it. Can I just... Can I... Listen, it's starting to rain. Can I just get up there? <laughs> so anyway, this is a place that we'll actually spend a little bit of time at because we can actually complete everything on this particular oasis right here and now. Uh, the only issue is I have to remember how in the world I get up there. Oh hey, I can make I can put a little pestle out here. Anyway, I'm gonna skirt around you here because I don't need to talk to you right now. To which I hear you say, "Scooter, you can't talk to that." That's a that's a that's a door. Also, we didn't need the hookshot to get up here. I'm smart. So we could have gotten this earlier, but hey. Who wants to see the last treasure chart? At least I'm pretty sure it's the last treasure chart. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the last treasure chart in the Wind Waker. Getting the treasure is going to be a whole other beast of a whole other nature. I'm being pushed out, I'm being bullied! <laughs> My own private oasis is bullying me! Anyway. 
Oh yeah, remember how I was talking about a bit? I can finally do it. Imagine drinking water. This post brought to you by Soup Gang. Anyway, we don't have... Actually, wait. We do have to get this out, so... I would recommend getting yourself a grappling hook, of all things. Your hammer in a second, but for now... Grab your deed. Well, actually... I'm decorating my home the way I wish. Up touch. Listen, these are not mine. This is mine. Do I have another spot around here, by the way? You know what? Those are my only two, but that's fine. Those are mine now. Anyway, from your mailbag, you're going to want to procure your deed. Because you're going to go up to this and you're going to just say, Oh, hey, open the door. Don't touch me with those fizzy hands, you mischievous little scamp. Ahem, this cabana belongs to the master, and the master alone. You grimy, trespassing little scoundrel. Away with you. Away, I say. Uh, here's a problem. I am the master. And clean, must fall. Don't let those grudgy hands. Wait, uh, that, that's, that. Uh, uh, why, that's the, are you, are you the new master? Are you Master Link? Are you a sentient door with a bit of sass? You know I got fire arrows. I can take care of this really quick. Ah, I'm so pleased to, to hear that name. Master Link. Please be gentle on this fine door. Oh, 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 Jesus. <laughs> but. Anyway. Oh, God. Oh, criminy. So, how long has that been there? Anyway, so there is a puzzle we have to do in this room. Well, one or two puzzles. Uh, wait, the deed doesn't work here, Link. Speaking of the deed not working here, let's put the deed away for a minute, because we're going to need this in a second. Anyway, uh, oh, we can get this right away. Now, there is something else we can do within the private oasis, which is a sliding puzzle. Uh, I do. Okay, the Oxalation Mode game. Sure! I will place the final panel in the top right space to complete the painting. So this is a, sli this is a sliding panel puzzle. Now, I'm very bad at these. And you ever need, if you ever need a reference, there's one on the wall behind you. Uh, this could take me a while. But yeah, like I said, I am very bad at this. Actually, hold on. These just go up here. Okay. We'll fix that later. Nope, other way. Uh, and my of course, immediately my brain is fighting it because my head says, hey, press... Don't press this direction, press that direction. Alright, anyway. Uh, I need to get this in order over here, so... Which is weird, because my grandmother used to have, like, one of these sliding puzzles, and I used to play it all the freaking time. Uh, actually, this is not as hard as I th I'm thinking it is, is it?
Okay. Um, I'm definitely going to cut ar that around a bit. But, uh, I did it. So what do we do all that for? Some money. He pooped out money, by the way. So anyway, so you can do that multiple times, I believe, and it gets harder and harder with each iteration, granting you more money the more you do it. I'm going to break my stuff. I don't need my stuff. I'm breaking it. I'm still going to break my stuff. Also, you have loads of money just stored in your coffers around the place. But there is more to this private oasis than meets the eye. And I don't know how I'm going to cut that up or if I'm going to just speed it up. Probably not speeding it up because I didn't say a damn word while I was doing it. But I think it'll actually be enough for this time. So next time, we have only this location and two other islands to go to. But I think once we get done with that, we'll end up... Uh, We'll end up getting to that point where I said we're going to go on a great treasure hunt. Ooh, there's more up there. So anyway, everyone, I do want to thank you all so much for watching this episode of The Wind Waker. And come back next time. We will see what um, unsightly things exist in our own little cabana. I'll see you folks next time. Take care.